published in 1937, Of Mice and Men is one of John Steinbeck's most important works. The novella shows the devastating impact that the Great Depression had on many Americans' ability to achieve their dreams. John Ernst Steinbeck Jr. was born in Salinas, California on February 27, 1902. Steinbeck was in and out of his studies at Stanford University, but never graduated. During this time, Steinbeck worked as a bindle stiff, along with many migrant workers. This experience was the primary influence on Of Mice and Men. In 1930, he married Carol Henning, and they moved into a rent-free cottage belonging to the Steinbeck family in Pacific Grove, California. His first literary achievement came with the publication of Tortilla Flat, a story about lawless countrymen and their devotion to friendship. After the breakthrough novel Tortilla Flat, Steinbeck wanted to explore the plights of the common laborer. He began working on Of Mice and Men in 1936. Now, Of Mice and Men became an immediate success and continues to be read throughout the world to this day. Even so, it has proved to be controversial due to objections over its offensive language and sexual depictions. Starting in the 1950s, the novel was banned in various places. In 1962, Steinbeck was awarded the Nobel Prize for Literature. He died in New York City on December 20th, 1968. Of Mice and Men is set in California during the Great Depression. During this time, fruit farms in the West employed many migrant workers. The jobs, however, offered extremely poor housing and harsh work conditions. In addition, the novel is set during the Dust Bowl. This leaves characters desperate for work, as many fruit farms during this time were not performing well. The plot begins with George and Lenny sitting beside a riverbed, talking about a dream of owning a small farm someday. The two go to work at a ranch and receive hostility from the boss's son, Curly. Now they try to stay out of trouble, befriending some of the ranch's workers. Curly's wife comes around to flirt with the men who are <laughs> uninterested due to her being Curly's wife. George and Lenny tell an old worker, Candy, about their dream, and they partner to try to raise money to buy the dream farm. Curly's hostilities come to a head when he picks a fight with Lenny, who in response crushes Curly's hand. While the men are in town, Curly's wife flirts with Lenny. Her flirting results in Lenny accidentally killing her. He runs to the pool by the riverbed and waits for George. George arrives and kills Lenny out of mercy. Some of the symbols in Of Mice and Men include the pool, which symbolizes a safe haven, free of the troubles of the world, soft, vulnerable animals. These illustrate the dramatic irony that Lenny, a kind and gentle man, is prone to accidentally killing small animals. Candy's old dog symbolizes the fate of the migrant worker. Once they are no longer useful, they will be discarded. There are also three main themes featured in Of Mice and Men. The dream, the common dream that migrant workers share of owning their own property someday, but never achieve. Then there's loneliness and friendship. The loneliness characters feel contrasts with the friendship Lenny and George have. Many characters are lonely and bitter, leaving them in search of friendship. Entrapment, meaning there are few options in life as a migrant worker, often leading to inevitable situations that are unfavorable. Of Mice and Men captures an important period in American history while highlighting difficult truths about loneliness and the importance for striving for individual dreams. These truths have resonated with readers for generations.